Hey, what's up guys? Uh, this is DJ Kroba. Welcome back. Another short masterclass about post-production, but today we're suckling down on deliverables, all right? So let's go straight into the point. When you're dealing with uh, these big streaming companies like Mnet, the owners of Showmax, Netflix, Apple TV, Amazon, HBO, you name them. When you deliver audio, for these people, they don't just need one file, they need multiple files. So this video, I'm gonna break it down for you on what you need to do so that you can be able to deliver these videos at the level at which they want them to be. So let's go right in and dig in into our session. So uh, this movie that I'm about to show you, it's a short film. It's a multi-award winning short film. It's known as Extravagangsta. It was under the competition of 48 hours. This is courtesy of ADMI Institute. Let me play you guys a minute or 45 seconds or 50 seconds of, of this production uh, for you guys to just hear the mix, all right? His tragedy, well, nothing short of spectacular. It was... Um the 20th of November, 2022, and, um... Good. Boss. But don't Yeah. It was... the 20th of November, 2022. <laughs> Yo, let me tell you something. Ain't no one appreciates a genius when they're looking them in the face. You know what I'm talking about? I am the Van Gogh of my time. I am literally the... So, like, that nigga was big, okay? Six, six, six foot, like, like, six foot five, yeah? Picture Goliath, mammoth of a, of a, of a, of a, of a man. What to Alliance? What's up? <laughs> so that's the movie. It's known as Extra of a Gangster. Love this picture, man. Hope you guys get to enjoy these things, man. Our film is just amazing. So let's go into our deliverables and what is required. Let me zoom in here so that I show you. These, these red parts are the deliverables, but I need to explain context. I need to explain the different layers that we have in film uh, in, a, in a minute. So the purple part that you're seeing right here is the dialogue. Now, Yona, this purple, this is the dialogue of the whole picture. Uh, the dark blue is all the music that is used in the picture. All right. Um, the yellow is SFX. I'm sure you could notice the transitions when they were playing here and there. You could hear some of that SFX. The light blue is the ambience or the background. You know how those environments sound like. You know, if you're in an apartment, in a studio. So you have to layer down your ambience so that it's not very dry. And then finally, the green is the SFX. The folly, the folly, the green is the folly. I'm sure when the guy turned around, you could hear there was a cut and something and something fall down. Those things were not on location. They were just added on post to add more drama to the scene. So when you're doing your deliverables, eh, the first thing you have to deliver, and let me zoom in here, is the actual mix, the final mix of the whole production. Very important for you to deliver that. Then a dialogue by itself, the dialogue print only by itself in this case we it is abbreviated as dx here on my on my on my session and then mx is the music the music separately and then fx is the sound effects and the folly separately sound effects folly and ambience separately and then finally is mne mne is music and effects so this is music sfx folly and backgrounds all that separately and the reason why and it's always good to know why we have to do this thing this is there are there are two reasons to it one is to future proof the project and it's if a movie like this becomes big it has to be translated into another language let's say they want it in french or they want it in arabic or or mandarin or any other really really big language or portuguese or spanish so the reason you submit things like this is so that the people who will be doing the ultimate um, uh, distribution, they have these audio files that they can work with so that the only thing they have to do is the dialogue, which is now the translation. So they have to hire voiceover actors and reperform those lines again. So the picture is now workable, all right? So I hope this one has made sense. 
why we have to deliver all these audio files to these big streaming companies. Uh, if you really want to stand out, you have to be that guy. All right. Maybe next what we should do is I should like break down how to create a session like this in the DAW that you prefer. Uh, in this case, may I use Pro Tools, but I can show you how to do this in any DAW. It's pretty simple. All right, you guys keep well, success. See you guys in the next picture.